The Netlify CMS is a content management solution built on a Git workflow. And I'm gonna show you how to get started today. Head over to the Get Started button, which will bring you in the NetlifyCMS.org documentation on how to get started with the template. Now these are actually one-click templates. And here you can see we have two different choices, which is the Gatsby template and the Hugo template. Both are valid in popular static site generators, but I'm gonna pick the Hugo template for now. Once you've clicked the button, you'll arrive onto the Netlify dashboard where you can now connect to your GitHub account. This is necessary for using GitHub as your backend. You do have options to choose other providers as a backend, uh, but for now we'll use GitHub. But if you're interested in trying a different backend, consult the Netlify CMS documentation to see how. I'm gonna go ahead and choose save and deploy, which now brings me to my site dashboard. Now this is a brand new site that's being created based on this template. And here we can see that we have a build in the process of being deployed. Now that my site's deployed, I can just go ahead and scroll all the way to the top where I can preview my deploy live. Now what we're looking at is the actual template itself that's built on Hugo, which is the basic marketing site with a bunch of content. So what you didn't see is in my email, I have an invitation to accept an invite to join my CMS as a creator. I went ahead and went to my email and accepted the invite to become an admin on my CMS, which is now prompting me to set up a password within the identity network. And finally, now I have access to the CMS where now I can see the content that's live on my site. And now that I have created an account through Identity, I now have access to the CMS to start creating content for my new template.